So I'm gonna show you how to sign up for Amazon Flex as a driver and pretty much how to get started. It's a very simple process, but a couple things you need to know before you get started. So let's go to the website, which is Amazon Flex. Um, you can see the URL right here, flex.amazon.com, or you can just type on amazonflex.com and it will bring you to this main website. So unlike other apps for gig work like DoorDash, Uber Eats, Lyft, and Uber, you can't just go straight up to the Google Play Store or iOS Apple Store to download the app and get started. You have to go to the website and go to their link. Um, but before we get started, let's talk about what you need in order to become a driver. Now you can read all this stuff to learn what, about more about it. Um, it's very straightforward. This is what they claim you can make, 18 to $25 an hour. That can be true at some times. But let's talk about what you need to drive. So you're gonna click on let's drive. And if you go down, you're gonna see what you need. Pretty much, uh, you're gonna see if you live in a city that has Amazon Flex, you have to be 21 or older. Of course, you need a license and you need a mid large vehicle, um, mid size, large size vehicle, four door sedan. And of course, your trusty phone, iPhone LOS. You can click here to see more requirements. Now, if you wanna see the list of cities that are available so you know for sure that you can drive, click on this link, we'll open it. And as you see, this is all the cities they're currently recruiting in. Uh, some spots may be limited, which means there might be a waiting list. This might happen to you, so you won't know until you sign up. As you can see right here, all the states that are available. So I live in Washington State, and that state is not presented because we are our field. There are no more signings for Washington State. So it kind of tells you um, what states are oversaturated. Okay, once you read into all that, it's time to download the app. You click right here. So this is the uh, page to download the app. Use your phone, scan it with the photo app on your phone to get this QR code to sign up. Again, they don't use Google Play or iOS. They use their own installer package on for their app, which means when you do updates for uh, Amazon Flex, the driver app, you will have to update through the app. Now I can't show you like a new sign up because I'm already signed up as a driver. What I can show you is once you sign up, this is what your app will look like. I will have screenshots for you so you can check it out. So when you do sign up, they're gonna ask you for your name, of course, your, your ID, pretty much uh, put that information in, and your phone number. This is, it goes by your phone number, and of course, you gotta take a picture, a profile picture, as you can see right here. And this is the main page for your um, Amazon Flex, right? This is your pretty much dashboard slash settings, and we're gonna go through some of this stuff to get you started. Very straightforward. So on that main page, you're gonna see the settings on that taskbar that you saw earlier in the last uh, screenshot that was right here. Then you're gonna start putting your information in. So your personal information, all the details, your tax info. I'm not gonna do that because that stuff is confidential, but as you see right here, I have to block out my phone number. And you're gonna see all the stuff you need to know, but once you click on personal information, you're gonna go to the next page. And also you'll see right here, there's check for updates, which you can manually check for, or I'll automatically update for you every time you load up the app. So once you click personal information, you can put in the most basic stuff, as in, you know, your address, your driver's license if you need to change that, your vehicle information, your bank account, your tax info, your insurance, your uh, status for this stuff and your permits for alcohol. Uh, the most important things for you to actually have done before you drive is pretty much your bank, tax, insurance, your vehicle information, and driver's license. That's the main thing. These two, uh, this is optional. And this, it can vary from state to state, but in my state, they don't require that. So do all that. Then we can get started on the next couple things. So once you fill out all your information, you will need to go back to the main page and click on this taskbar and you're gonna click on learning portal. Everything you need to learn about Amazon Flex as a driver, how to do it, all these steps and tasks are through the portal. Your text for you to read or videos. Um, in this case, I don't need to show you the videos because you're gonna watch it yourself. So when you're learning portal, you're gonna see all these categories, you know, getting a block, picking up delivery, taxes and earnings. Each section will have a read through and also a video that you can watch. And it's very in-depth, it's very intuitive, very helpful. It, it, it helps you out a lot when you're starting off and it's better than most uh, gig apps um, when it comes to tutorials and getting you started. Very good. Look through it, spend some time, spend about an hour or so looking through this information. And as you can see, this is an example of one of the, uh, the tutorials, you know, starting a block. You can see a one minute read, two minute read and watch. Those are the type of things you expect for these tutorials. Very short, very easy. So when you've gone through all the tutorials, you're gonna pretty much go back to your main page or home page, which kind of looks like this. And this is the taskbar that you saw earlier with all the drop down options. Um, this is pretty much what you'll see when you load the app every time. You can read these little things that come up. You can check for updates. You can see your schedule. 
which is the blocks that you've already signed up for. When you signed up for blocks and you click on the schedule option on that home page, you're gonna see the calendar, all of the available blocks that you uh, sign up for. In my case, I didn't sign up for any blocks this month or this week. And you go to your taskbar, you're gonna see of course the schedule like I mentioned earlier, the offers, and this is what you wanna click to start signing up for blocks. Click on that. And here you'll see offers. You're gonna see pretty much the offer amount, uh, it's ninety six dollars. We're gonna see the time limit that they're gonna estimate you're gonna be finished with, and the location and the time slot. These are the offers we're gonna see. You can scroll all the way down. This is just a screenshot, and this is where you start signing your blocks and seeing what works for you. And you can always click refresh if there's new blocks coming in. And if you click on filter, you can filter what kind of blocks you want. So for Amazon Flex, there's multiple types of deliveries. There's the uh, Amazon Fresh deliveries, which is pretty much groceries, or Prime Now, which is pretty much a two hour window deliveries. Then there's pretty much the basic logistics, which is warehouse deliveries, which is gonna be something like this, amazon.com. That's pretty much warehouse package deliveries. And these other things that I don't know too much about, but you can filter out what kind of delivery type you wanna do or what time you want to deliver for. So very good to see less options and to see more of a focused list of options for you to pick from to schedule. So you can do that with filters. So once you pretty much schedule a shift then you follow the instructions to go to the location and you're gonna start driving there. Um, it's very straightforward. Again, this video is not about how to like deliver the stuff, it's just how they get started. And once you finish your deliveries, you're gonna have a um, details on how you did. You're gonna see like little stats right here on the sand details tab. And you also get to see little perks like having rewards, which can give you cash back on certain things. Kind of like Uber Eats Pro, if you have that, same thing. Now the most important part about Amazon Flex, of course, is the money, the earnings. So as long as you did all your personal information, your banking stuff, your money should get deposited to your earnings uh, once you finish your delivery. You get paid two times a week, Tuesdays and Fridays, and if you do click on this earnings page, this is what you'll see. As you can see here, these are my previous deliveries right here. You know, $96, $96, $192 deposit, which is $96, $96. You can see the dates I finished it. I did two blocks this day, a block this day, and so on. So that's pretty much the earnings page. That's just pretty much the gist of starting Amazon Flex. You sign up, very easy, put in all your credentials, look through the app, do the tutorials, and that you go from there. Again, this video is not for how to drive, it's just how to get started and how to sign up. So hopefully this was helpful for you and good luck on your journey of being an Amazon Flex driver. This app is very intuitive, so I believe you'll be fine. Have a good day, Rain City Dreamer, out.